गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट वेलकम इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ चैप्टर नंबर वन सो इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द लीव एंड द विनेशन इन लीव देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ विनेशन रेटिकुलेट एंड पैलर विनेशन टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द फंक्शन ऑफ द लीव एज यू ऑल नो डेट द मेन फंक्शन ऑफ द लीव टू प्रिपेयर फूड फॉर द प्लांट सो थ्रू द प्रोसेस ऑफ फोटो सिंथिस ग्रीन प्लांट मेक द फूड एंड फोटो मीन्स the light and synthesis means the process or preparing so in the presence of with carbon dioxide you know plants take the carbon dioxide along with the water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll that is a green pigment present in the leaves make the sugar that is the food and oxygen along with the water so leaves have a green pigment called chlorophyll that traps energy of sunlight using this energy leaf prepare the food in the form of simple sugar by the process of photosynthesis so photosynthesis is the process of preparation of food by the plants with the help of carbon dioxide and water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll and the by product and the product made by the photosynthesis is sugar oxygen and the water during photosynthesis leaves utilize the sunlight trapped by the chlorophyll so chlorophyll trap the sunlight then convert carbon dioxide and water into sugar or the food and the sugar is stored as starch in the leaves so in the plants sugar is stored as starch then second function of leaf the exchange of gases leaves have the small pores or holes known as the stomata on their surfaces on the surface of the plant they have very minute openings known as the stomata from this stomata the exchange of gases take place means plants take carbon dioxide and gives oxygen then third function of leaf is transpiration so excess of water in the plants evaporate through the stomata pore this process is called transpiration so excess of water plant in the plants evaporate through the stomata and what is the main function of the transpiration it helps in cooling the surface of the leaf and also it create the suction force that help in upward movement of water in the plant so generally we give water in the roots through the transpiration process it help in the suction force that water reaches to the top of the plants means from the root system to the shoot system and in the next video i will show the activity which shows the transpiration in plants